Hi guys, this is Clarita and I'm one of the contributing writers to Be Chic Mag. Today I want to share with you a really quick and simple makeup look that you can use to work, to school, or just on any day that you want to go out. Most of the products that I'll be using are from the Essay Edit line that launched right before the summer. And so to start off, I'll be using the Pore Vanish Shoe Stick. The Pore Vanish Shoe Stick you can either wear it in the morning, it's the first thing. Next up would be putting on some foundation. I personally use the Becca Aqua Luminous Foundation right here. And it's just really easy to put on your face. And it also gives you a bit of a measure. I personally have dry skin, so I always like to make sure that my skin looks dewy and just natural. Usually like two or three drops is enough. Not that much. To blend it out, I always use my beauty blender. So. Okay, so as you can see, it kind of gives you a little bit of a glow, but not too much, and it still looks pretty natural. Now we're just going to contour and highlight specific areas, nothing too crazy, something very easy. We're going to be using the MAC Matchmaker Concealer, and I have them in a light shade as my highlight. And then number seven as my contour. Nobody can really tell that you have a full face of makeup on. In the morning, I don't have that much time to do a whole eye look. But I did try out the eyeshadow palette right here. It was the edit and it was made by Kendall Jenner and Irene Kim. I tried it out, but some of the colors weren't as pigmented and there was a lot of fallout. So I only use one or two of the colors when I'm in a rush. Okay, And we'll be using this one right here. Here and this one right here. One of my favorite products from the collection are these eyeshadow sticks. I'll be using the color Gill and just putting it on the corner of my eye just to make it pop just a little bit. It's a small step, but it makes a big difference. For my mascara, I use both Smashbox Full Exposure and Too Faced Better Than Set. I use them both together because they're able to give me length and volume. To complete this daytime look, just add on some lip liner or your favorite lipstick. So there you have it, this is my regular day look. And if you work at an office and you have plans after work with friends or family, I'm going to teach you how to take this look from day to night. Remember those eyeshadow sticks from earlier? You can use a darker color, like brown did, and apply it at the corners to have a little bit of a smoky eye. Another way you can turn this into a nighttime look is by adding some blush, because it just adds more of a pop to your face. I'll be using the Estee Edit Koi Coral. And it's really good, especially for the summer, because it makes you just look happy and bright and it's still pretty natural. I know this looks weird, but this really helps. Our last step is just adding some highlight. Because you want to make sure that when you're taking that Instagram picture, you can like highlight on sleep. So you can highlight it for your eyes. A cat eye does make a big difference. And for those of you that didn't have time in the morning to do that cat eye, now is the time to do it. You can either keep the same shade of lipstick, but I actually want to try something new. Estee Lauder came out with this Lip Flip Shade Transformer. I haven't tried it before, but supposedly it darkens your lip shade. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda scared about trying this. I think I'm 
using this wrong because this color isn't very flattering so I would I would go out with this. Yeah, fail. That was my day tonight look. I just want to thank you guys for watching. Make sure to comment and subscribe right below. And once again, this is Clarissa for bchicmag.com. Bye!